Tally ho everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Civilization V Brave New World, playing as the Mayans, the Mayans, the Mayans, ha 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 ha, and yes, we are back, we are back Um, yeah, I'm gonna get another worker, just because we, ne we need it, you know, we need to build up the infrastructure here, it is absolutely abysmal, because of these barbarians. I am going to send this guy to go and take care of business here. Um, would be helpful to have some reinforcement, but I'm not going to bother with that too much. Yes! Welcome! Welcome back! I was going to get that choral music, but oh, for goodness sake, there's another there? Right, am I pledging to protect both these? Yes, good. Right, so luckily you're dead. And I can get a great engineer now. I can't get another great scientist because yeah, uh, I like how it tells you which Bakhtun you chose it to celebrate. Alright, but we are going to get a great engineer. Yes. Now let's please hope that whatever happens here is not the same thing that happened when we got trolled by a certain, you know, who. Right, we got Norbert Rillo, sounds French. Um, yeah, I'm going to do this. There's just no way we could get that, um, even if I plopped him down. But that's fine. We've got plenty, plenty of good tiles to build farms on. Um, and all of that jazz. And it would be really nice just to pop that extra great profit. And to get, you know, more faith going. This is going to be a very faith-based civilization, I think. We're going to be very religious and pious. And when I do get more great profits, I'll probably pop them all down everywhere. Alright, another religion's been founded. Confucianism. Um, hopefully we're left with something good, like... Gardens provide. That's fine. Gardens, I don't care about. Alright, we got the Hagia Sophia. Oh, for goodness sake. Aha! Hagia Sophia! Which, which makes our temple now free in our city. As you can see there. And it gives us a free great profit, which I can now use to enhance my religion. Aha! So now we're going to grab. What are we going to grab? Do, do, do. These are all kind of terrible. Oh, these really suck. Oh, man. They suck so much. Ugh. Ugh. Disgusting. Okay. We'll get religious community then. I was really hoping to get, like, the plus two happiness from temples. Damn it. Alright, well, what I wanted here is... Has it already been taken? No way. Really? Oh, come on! Oh, everything good's been taken. This is so stupid. Alright, I'm going to get Messiah, because Messiah will help us get more great profits. Um, which is great. <laughs> which is very great. Um, <laughs> right there. I need to move you along. Oh, for goodness sake. I can't, I can't move him too far. I really want to just, like, upgrade him. But I'm waiting on that decision. I'm waiting for uh, mathematics. Where's mathematics? Oh, we've already got mathematics! What am I doing? Oh, we should be getting that judiciary court, but we need the worker. <laughs> you see what I mean, guys? There are so many things I need to get, and, like, you can only get one thing at a time. I could, I could, okay, I could annex this. I could. <sighs> I didn't really want to keep it. Oh, you know what? We, I think we are going to annex this. It's, it's not a bad city. I mean, it's bad right now because it's not really got any good tiles to work. It's not terrible. It's not terrible. It's not the best city in the world. But yeah. No, we've got to do it. I, I need to start, like, you know. If, if it's going to be a city of mine in the future, I need to start utilizing it to its full potential. And also, I really want to get this pagoda. And I really want to get another pyramid. Um, but we will finish that granary. That granary. Granary, granary. It's all the same to me. And yes, unfortunately, he's going to pillage that. Oh, for Goodness sake. So silly. <laughs> so yes, our site's gonna go downhill again. Oh man. Just all these issues. I mean it's really adding a lot of culture to the game. Like, well, you know, it's it's adding a lot of experiences. I mean, it'll be very entertaining for you guys. So watching me just like winning outright. You know, a lot I've watched a lot of Let's Plays where it's like that, and it's like you can see the end coming. It's just like, yeah, it's gonna be, it's, it's, it's gonna be like an outright win. <laughs> so you're just watching the next like 50 turns. It's like, oh, nah. In this situation, you guys have no idea. I have no idea if I'm gonna be able to pull through this. 
Like, damn! Um, I might have to do some serious, like, in a war in the future. Uh, and I can't move there because then he can move to there. Oh, this is, this is completely and utterly completely bonkers. It's bonkers! Bonkers, I say! Oh, no. Yeah. So, Thieves, you managed to hold out to make a religion. It's probably not a very good religion. I mean, we've got a good religion. Not a great one because this silly Pantheon one. Not Pantheon, this follow belief. It's not a bad follow belief, but you do generally need a large population for it to be, you know, actually decent. Oh, well, at least it looks kind of more like a university now, or academy. Alright, let's finish the job. I'm actually, no, I need, I need to repair these. I need to clear these encampments. Man, never before has this been such an issue for me. I mean, I almost feel like I should just get honor so I can, like, get culture for it. Because that's what honor does. Um, honor allows you to get culture from barbarian kills. And it makes killing barbarians a lot easier as well. So there is that. There is that kind of thing to consider. And then I could just have, like, the most all-round, like, you know, empire in the world. In terms of policy, uh, culture, kind of, yeah. Alright, repair that. You just heal. And then once we have that other work, we'll be able to start building and rebuilding at the same time. Also, we will need that um, courthouse eventually, but as you can see, it's a very, very long way away. Yes. But once I have my uh, composite bowman, man, it is so on. Like, we're going to go straight for Thebes. We're just going to hammer it, and we're going to take it, and it's going to be done. <laughs> But yeah, we do need that uh, Judiciary Court first, which will take us a while to build. <sighs> I mean, you could use a great engineer on that, but I mean, why would you? Alright, I'll move you down here so we can try and take out that encampment. Yes, somebody's probably going to appear over here, and it's going to be extremely annoying. Am I working anything terrible? Um, well, everything's kind of terrible now anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Not really. Phoebes! How are you feeding? Feed now. Puns. So so hard. What a gem of a city site. <laughs> oh, man. Kill me! Uh, yeah, Thebes is a great city though. It's got that jay, it's got that deer that it could work. And it's got the crabs and the fish. It's, it's beautiful. It, it's more of an Alexandria, but yeah. Alright, that's fine. We can do that. Okay, so you've grown. Um, do I want to work that? It's the only thing that's actually half decent to work. So yes, I want to work that. <laughs> Sugar! Spice! And everything nice. So once we've got these two, and then we'll do that, and then we'll grab this finally. Because it would be nice to actually have this, you know, Kind of with an extra food on it instead of sitting there with one foot because it's not uh, it looks ugly it's a, it's like a tundra tile that's what it is it's like a tundra tile tundra tiles just have the one food on them and it's just it looks terrible it's like ew that can't sustain my populace my populace <laughs> my populace oh, what am i on right here we go next turn Ah, uh, yeah, you rebuild. Actually, if you rebuild, that's fine, because man, it'd be so nice if you could clear all these marshes. Because, you know, then my troops standing on them won't get that, that negative bonus thing. This is what you get. Um, marsh. So this is your negative modifier for standing in uh, a marsh. This is really, really not good. Wait, what is that? Free movement. Oh, free movement cost to go into a marsh, yep. So, you're standing in a lot of crap, is what it's saying. Right, I'm going to assume this wasn't a scout and safely say I can do this. Oh, well, it doesn't matter because you came along anyways. You suck. You shuck. All right, now I can... Um, actually, I'm going to do this. Yep. We're going to start getting everything back into order now. This is great. You're trying to spread your religion. That's fine. It doesn't even matter if he spreads it to here because, um, because we already bought the pagoda there. But no, you're spreading overseas. I don't know what... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Do you have another city somewhere? 
Oh, oh, I'll bet. I, oh. Oh, I bet he does. If he is another city somewhere, that would actually be really convenient to me. Hmm, maybe. Because, I mean, we don't have to settle as many cities that way. Alright, I'm just gonna... Everybody, just everybody. You know, everybody always likes to come and screw with me. It's so frustrating. But I am going to do that anyways. Because maybe Melbourne can help me! Melbourne. Mm. Alright, build that plantation. It's gonna take 18 turns. So, it's not like it's a, uh... It's not like it's a merry-go-round. 403 turns for great science. That, man. At least, at least he hasn't repaired that catapult. I mean, that's a bit silly. Oh, I see you want to spread it to Melbourne. Ah, oh, I don't need that. Like, I don't need to be cleaning up your mess, Egypt. It's a good thing that Me uh, Memphis already converted, I think, so. Oh, no, I think it went away again. But we did get the pagoda here. So it is here to stay. I am keeping Memphis now. I've bought that pagoda. There's no way I'm going to raise a city that I spent 240 faith to keep, essentially. <laughs> but yes, we will be going to war again with Egypt very soon. I just, I need to get this. Yep. It's not hard to get. We just need to get that judiciary court and then we'll be able to do it. And I will probably bring this, uh, this dude back around. Of course you're coming. God, everybody. Alright, maybe maybe Melbourne can... I don't want Melbourne to clear this stuff. That's the... Oh, why can't you just help me with the problem? Oh. Because then that barbarian's going to come down. Oh. Oh, okay. Well, that gives me an opportunity for that. Right. Oh, Reformation Belief. Alright, so we got our Reformation Belief. What do I want? Yep, there it is. To the glory of God, use faith to purchase any type of great person starting in the industrial era. That is exactly what I want. I mean, sure, there's all this other cool stuff, like influence boost to, to city-states 30%. Um, <laughs> this would be really good for us right now, just get a missionary and convert all the barbs. But we don't need them. We don't need those converts. Uh, most of these aren't as good as, as they might seem. That one's really good if you want to, like, massively spread your religion. It's pretty huge. But yeah, I'm going to get to the glory of God. Right now, it does not impact us at all. So it's it's basically useless. Oh, we got a great prophet. All right, for finishing, for finishing that. But I'm actually going to plop him down because he gives massive bonuses to everything. Uh, I'm going to put him on, like, these three tiles are going to be my great prophet tiles. Because um, I want to save all the rivers for uh, farms. Yep. Hopefully these will yield um, grasslands tiles. I think they will. I mean, could be plains, but if they are, well, damn. Brah! See, I could have gotten that, but I, I really don't care. I got the two best of them. Actually, the best combo is to get the Great Mosque of Dejen and then build Baropador. But that's if you've got, like, an entire continent, like, a massive, you know, five to six player continent and you want to spread like crazy. Like, it's good for that. All right. What is that? All oh, right. Borders expanding. Yes, you won't be able to get to my great prophet, which is good because I'd be really, really, I'd be really peed, peed off if you did. Did you build Boropador? No. That would have been great because then we would have been able to get another wonder. Why are you making so many missionaries? <laughs> oh, oh, Egypt. I am actually probably going to be attacking you. Like, you, you, these aren't going to even get anywhere. Like, that that is just how it's going to be. That is how it is going to be. Resources available. That's interesting. I never, I never thought about that. That's cool. Alright, so what will this create? Yep, it'll create a grassland style. And it'll give us all these bonuses. Yep, I know, right? Isn't that amazing? Oh, yes. That's a fantastic tile. Alright, I'm actually going to move you to here, because I think he's about to clear that marsh. But yes, but the reason why we get all these bonuses is because of our religion. Um, I mean, because of our piety. So yes, piety is pretty good. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Oh, goodness. Stop it! <laughs> so we've got Theocracy, which gives plus three uh, gold to all holy sites. 
And once you complete piety, you get plus free culture from all holy sites. So free gold and free culture from all holy sites makes me a very happy man. Yes, I am a man. <laughs> oh dear. Right, now what do I want? What do I want? What do I want? I don't know, I'll probably start uh, clearing all these forests as well. Maybe get that judiciary court like two turns faster or something. Da -da -do. This is awesome, yes. So what? So my main goal is to get tons of these holy sites. Just like, you know, get a huge culture. Our culture right now is massive. And then once we get all those ball courts, like, ho ho, yes, we are going to be the culture machine. So my aim in this game is kind of leaning towards cultural victory. But it might still go, I might still go for something else. You know, diplomatic victory or... Or, uh, what's the other one? The third one. There's domination. There's military. There's diplomacy. Military, diplomacy, culture, and... What's the other one? <laughs> what is it? I don't remember. Why am I being such an idiot? Oh, science. Science victory! We might get science victory. Because the mines can into space. Well, they could into space. <laughs> they could! But that's not how the joke goes, is it? Stop standing on my dear. Oh. Can't win. Yes, this is getting better. I like it. We've had a few trials. We've had to go through a few trials by Barbarian. But I think we're going to pull through. Unless you decide, you know, you want to swing round to here. Now, I think he's just kind of covering his base there. He's like, me, mm, me. Right, my city becomes religious. Is that Memphis? Good. I mean, he's probably going to screw it all up for me, but... Well, oh, no, right, he can't enter my territory. Oh, right, he can't get through. Oh, very nice. Very, very nice. It's very nice. It is very nice, indeed. And yep, our next great profit will be at 562. And we'll be able to get a great profit from our, um, our long count calendar, if I decide to do that, of course. Because I might end up getting a great merchant and then a great rider or something. Don't want to ignore the arts completely, considering we are possibly going for that. In fact, what I might go for next is... I think... Oh, where is it? Oh, I'm still getting used to this system. I might go down Liberty, but I might also go down Aesthetics. Because Aesthetics is very, very good. It's very good for culture. Well, Aesthetics means culture, essentially. Yasha Dash. Come here. Alright, so in f six turns, not five, six turns, we'll be able to get um, our, our, all of our Atlatlists upgraded to crossbowmen. Not crossbowmen. Oh, oh my god, somebody entered the, uh, holy crap -a -mole. Did they really? Okay, somebody entered the Renaissance. The Renaissance in the year 310 AD. Are you, are you kidding me? Are you joking me? What? Oh god! I think I'm actually screwed then. Oh my god, somebody's going very fast. Whoa. Alright, where is it? Diplomacy? What am I looking for? I'm looking for the tab that tells me the demographics. There we go. Whoa! Somebody is very far ahead. Oh my god. Oh my god. They're gonna eat me. Oh no. Timmy. And I always bring up Timmy. What did Timmy do? What did he do? What did he do? But yeah, I like that we've rebuilt our we're rebuilding our infrastructure here. That barbarian needs to die. But yes, we are essentially the old world here. Um Yeah, this part of the world is like the old world. Not the old world, the new world. This is the new world of the game. Because nobody's found us yet. And, you know, it's the mines. I mean, yeah, the Egyptians. But we've both got pyramids, you know? I mean, well, he didn't actually build his pyramids. <laughs> he got to build a great lighthouse, which is an Egyptian wonder. Um, <laughs> he didn't get to build the pyramids. It's like, oh, damn it. I wanted it all. All right, we'll get those the judiciary court next turn, which is great because then we can upgrade immediately next turn. And then we will declare war. Then we sound the drums of war. Da, 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 da. And Melbourne isn't an ally of them, right? No. 
I mean, I could make an alliance with them, but it would waste the um, the necessary funds required. Now, I now it did say that I don't need them to be in my territory, so I'm holding out for that. Yep. What is that? Da -da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. All existing. Yep. All right, we can do it now. So, boom. Yeah. Upgraded. Oh, yeah. Didn't actually... Well, they're, they're stronger. They're not that much stronger, but it should be enough to take Thebes now. I believe. Yep, my city becomes religious, and we have improved the Atlatlists. What else? We could enact some other decisions. But I might... I f Ooh, that's a pretty good one, actually. Oh. No. And no. No, we're going to save our our people. Arr! We're going to save our people. Um, what else do I want? Man, I need to build some stuff. Markets. No, water mill. Water mill. And then, and then a market. Yeah. I think that would be very good. All right. I think we have to do this oh, now. We are getting those from him. So will that screw us up too badly? No. <laughs> no. Aha! Declared war again! He wasn't prepared for that. Oh, and his horseman's gone. <laughs> oh, I might be able to, like, just start this, like, right now. Oh. I think I'm gonna have to do it, guys. I mean, he hasn't built walls, and he's still got this damaged, you know, catapult. Okay, so he did that. Didn't take him out, and I'll be able to get March on Midwings. Excellent. Now, how much damage can we expect to do against Phoebes? Quite a bit. Not, not like, a huge amount, but not so little. It has no effect. Okay, this is the time to panic, everybody. Are you panicking? I'm panicking! All right, you got March, so you should be able to survive, like, another hit. All right, we'll bring you closer. Actually, I do need you to go there. I kind of need you to go there as well. All right, bump. All right, you should be able to survive hits. All right, so we've got this worker, which is a victory in its own. All right, now don't, hopefully he doesn't bring back that horseman. But yeah, no, I think we've got the city. Because, like, we've already done that much damage. Don't kill him. Oh, thank goodness. He didn't kill him. <laughs> I hate losing units, guys. I really do. Yeah, no, he's not doing enough damage um, against us. So in two turns, we should be able to win. And then, I'll, and then I think I'll wrap this episode up. I mean, I think. Let me just see how much time we have left normally. Actually, no, we still have, like, ten minutes. Oh, okay. You're playing Starbound! You know, we might be Starbound. That might be a sign, guys. We, we're going to be Starbound, you know, to the to the stars, to go beyond Earth. I know, I really should play Beyond Earth for you guys. That'd be so fun. Um, No, don't go that way. Just keep going that way. Alright, yeah, but I had to move Midwings back because I was getting concerned. Bum, ba bum, ba bum, ba bum, ba bum. Ba -bum, ba -bum. Right, you can't hit from there, so that's actually not fun. Alright. But our guys should actually be good. Um, I might move you there, though, just, just so that you're not, you know, under any threat of danger. Now, they might bring those horses back, but they've got a lot of rivers to cross. They'd have to bring them across the ocean. Alright, you did that. That is, that is fine. <laughs> oh, he's going to get captured by barbarians. I hope. I really hope that happens. That would be so fun. Ah, oh, that would be fantastic. Fantastic. And then once we have the Great Lighthouse as well, we'll be able to, we'll have a platform to start um, exploring with the, you know, via, uh, via, via, via the ocean. All right, I'm going to bring you out to here. All right, now we're going to bump and bump and... Can you survive another hit? It doesn't matter, I can just do that. Thank you, Pakal! 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 Alright, and you can move back there. 
Yeah, this war's going to be over very soon. <laughs> like, wow. Oh, we're doing it, guys. We're taking revenge. Revenge for Merit. Merit. Pippin. Oh, man, he's got an atoll here as well. Oh, he almost, he almost destroyed Pakal, but he didn't. And now we've got a city. We've totally got a city. Oh, yes. And he got it. Oh, he captured it. Oh, but he already spread his religion. Oh, that's a shame. Done. Oh, well. I don't really care about, like, religion that much. I just, I want to, I don't know. I want the great prophets. That's all I want. I don't care which religion it is. As long as I get my great prophets. Daenerys! Where's my crown? Yes, I'm going to get your crown for you, Viserys. <laughs> uh, Alright, Pakal, you can do it. You have won nothing! Strike me down and my spirit shall pursue your soul under the very abyss. It sounds like, sounds like Obi-Wan, you know. You strike me down. I should come back more powerful than you could ever imagine. Alright, um, well, we want to pop it it. And now we've got his resources, we've got everything. Egypt lost its capital, and obviously our spy fled. And now, we're the only civilization in the game again! Well, you know, like, the only civilization we know of. But now, I can actually go and influence either of these city-states freely, without any competition until, like, somebody arrives and starts spoiling it for me. But yes, I've taken it. Now, I think I'll bring him back so that he can, um, you know, start working, working on this area here. Oh, I'm very happy about this, guys. I won! We've taken the island. Somebody built the Alhambra. Good for them. And now we can freely expand upon the... Upon... Upon... Well, across the continent. Which I want this area as well. Like, there are so many areas around that I want. I want the sugar. Somebody did tell me to get the Monopoly on sugar. Um, I think it was Midwings. So, I will be getting the Monopoly... Monopoly. Yes, we do actually have a really large army though. You can see that by that negative 10. Ooh, gift to the state. Good governments would sometimes prompt the nobility and businessmen of the realm to donate cash to the treasury. Yeah. Yes! 75 gold. It's not, it's not like 2,000 or anything. Oh my goodness. I want that. I want it. I'm coming for it. <laughs> that's, that's Egypt's um, settler, and now they've, you know, because now they've become a disjointed state, they can no longer settle it down. Oh, you actually decided to pop in for a bit of tea. Well, it's too bad you're not getting my great profit, because, man, man, that right, what the hell, why can't I, uh, oh, oh, that's weird. Alright, we'll pop you there, pop you there. Unfortunately, that does, however, mean that we are going to get everything pillaged again! Yay! I can't actually do anything here. I'm going to have to move you back to the city there. And you can just do that. Alright, well, everybody needs to kind of come home. Alright, time to spread out our army evenly. So you're going to Memphis. Uh, you st Oh, you. Oh, we got another worker! Alright, well... Well then. Well... I mean, I think we've got another work. No, no, I think it's the same one. Well, we've got a gift of a state, so that's nice. Somebody built the Ankara what? Ankara what? <laughs> uh, yeah, this is going to be an issue, because he's going to start pillaging everything. Oh, I, I really hate barbarians. I, I, that's one reason to settle the rest of the, of the land, because then we won't have these barbarian problems anymore. <sighs> Actually... Oh, what I should be doing is buying a unit in here, but I can't be bothered, guys. I've already got a massive army. You know, I don't care if he pillages everything. Oh, and and we can get another thing from our Mayan Long Camp cal calendar. Unfortunately, we can't get a wonder or anything, so I'm not going to bother with that aspect. I might even get another Great Prophet. No, not right now. No, we won't get another Great Prophet right now. All oh, right, we already did select that. Sorry. Um, <laughs> what's the date? What? Oh, I can't actually see. Um, hmm. We don't have any writing slots? I don't think we have any writing slots now. I don't get a great merchant. Really not good timing though, because, yeah, I think I'll send him to Ormus. 
I mean, I could plonk him down. Actually, I've got an idea. Oh, it's actually a really bad idea. No. Ah! So stupid. Man, I really, I really hate barbarians. All right, well, we might as well make him productive in the north. Oh, but we can't. All right, send these guys up north. This won't do. This will not do. This will not do at all. All right, we did get another worker. All right, so we can start clearing these damn marshes out. Um, I suppose you guys can just kind of stay here. Alright, so Turon is now the leader of this area. Good job! But yeah, I want this peninsula. It's a very... Such a cool peninsula. It's like connected by this area and then... Ah. I think we can make it viable like with two cities. We could put a city here. Mm -hmm. And then put a city there. City here can be the Crab City. And it'll have two... two three, oh no, it won't have two. Oh! Oh no, I could put it in the desert. Right, so one, two... Ah, oh, still wouldn't matter. Right! Well, that doesn't matter then. Yes, I know, you're pillaging all my crap. Stop pillaging my villaging! My pillage, my village. My village. My village. My village. My village. I don't know what any of that means. All made up. All made up. Alright, you can stay there. You are in command now, Admiral Piet. Actually, no, Toron, you can head to Memphis. And we'll make Midwings the commander of this area. Considering he bled very hard for this area. Might as well let him be in command. Whoa, okay. Well, he's not going to die, but... Ooh. Seabuck's rule. Actually, well, I mean, he can kind of hold, it, hold his own. He's pretty good. He didn't get enough practice to get enough promotion, though. You have to try harder, Anders. You have to try harder. Jeez. <sighs> Stop being a Cylon. Cylon! Shallow. Alright, we got Melbourne on our side, did we? No, we didn't. Okay, I don't know why that did that. Alright, because our spy arrived there. Right, excellent. We can start doing that. Right, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to move you back, and then I'll hit you. I don't think they can kill it with a spearman. I don't think. Yes, I don't think means that I know somehow. No, it doesn't. Right. Man, I hate barbarians! We were just getting everything back in order, and then they decided to come along and be like, Oh my god, this is so awesome. Don't mind if I just, you know, <laughs> kill everything. Ugh. Right, midwings, you're in charge of this area. If anything goes to crap, you are going to take the blame. You hold all the cards. Right. My alarm just went off. Might have actually been going off for a while. It's hard to see because of the glint of the sun on the phone. But yes, we, once this turn has ended, that is when we'll do it. But yes, we've taken Thebes. We already took Memphis um, a few episodes ago. And everything was getting back in order. But this guy decided that he would rather just... Let the world burn. Yeah, I'm gonna call him the Joker. You know, he wants everything to burn. Oh. Anyways, thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.